Welcome to Horizon Forbidden West Ultra Hard Difficulty. This is the final fight against the two wide mods in the cauldron. It is recommended that you run through cauldron Moo at level 18. I completed at level 12 on ultra hard difficulty and here is how I did it. If you're wondering what skills I used, wait until the end of the video and I'll break it down for you. Once activating the wide maw, I quickly ready my warrior bow and prepare to fire as many melee detonator arrows into the wide maw. This ensures I do maximum damage right out of the gate with my heavy attack. Keeping up with a flurry of light attacks to pump out as much damage as I can, the wide maw attempts to separate so I quickly move back in for another heavy attack, which knocks down the wide maw, allowing me to get some crit hits on as well as take advantage of the resonator blasts. Once the wide moth stands, I search for the best opportunities to follow up with heavy attacks. Once again, knocking it down. With the second wide moth in the fight, I make sure to always put the down wide moth between us. From here, I will always focus on performing heavy attacks and detonating any resonator blasts. Once I fill up my Valor Bar, I use my Toughened Valor Surge. This is going to provide me 80 health every 2 seconds and provide resistances to aid in the fight against the Wide Maws. If you watch, this buff will stay active for the remainder of the fight. Towards the end of the fight, I knocked down the second Wide Maw. Using this to my advantage, I focused everything on the first. This short time period was enough for me to finish off the first Wide Maw, leveling the playing field. When selecting skills in the Survivor Tree, all I cared about was getting two levels into Valor Surge toughened. The passive healing and resistances was a huge factor in the success of this fight. In the Hunter Tree, I was looking at increasing the speed at which I earned Valor buildup, so I selected the Valor Surge Master. The Warrior Tree is where all the damage came from. I want to increase melee damage as well as Resonator Blast damage and buildup. During the fight, my blasts are doing more damage than any of my crits. I also wanted to select melee detonator so I could open up with a ton of damage. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed the video.